Okay, here's the back of the uh, 5500. It looks, uh, it gets your full scale adjustment, your out voltage adjustment, which I have no idea what that's for. Um, basically, what this guy's done is he's ran these into uh, some Sense Jones plugs and what I've done is I've purchased some actual good wire, some heavier wire here to go on these to test. So. You can see he's put those on there as well. I just piggybacked them. So. Let's, uh. Turn the control box on here. Okay. So it's all the way to the left. There's the rotor. And she stopped on the meter, just continuing to spin, and she just jumped back to zero, continuing to spin. And now she's done. And it jumped over here on the meter. So, I am thoroughly confused. Maybe somebody can let me know. Is it these, uh, is it this crap here? Is it, uh, see, I don't, I thought for some reason the power cable on these were longer than 12 inches. Um, I don't think these came factory. I'm trying to figure out what gauge wire that is. If I can get it to zoom. Maybe it's a wire issue. Um, I did open both of them up and grease the bearings. Uh, they looked in really good shape, especially the AS rotor down here. Um, of course, everything was lined up. I lined it up with the line, you know, the line here to here before I took the pop off of it and grease the bearings, re-grease the bearings on it. Uh, the elevation one um, seems to work okay. Um, you know what? Well, actually, what I'm going to do is unplug that and put it Okay, now that's on the uh, elevation. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Okay.
Okay, something's definitely wrong here. Oh. Good thing these are wired correctly. Because I forgot to unscrew this and put it in the uh, elevation rotor. Did not mean for this to be this long, but... Again, same cable, uh, same, just piggyback for, for that. So, let's turn it on again. Okay. She's all the way down. So she's turning elevation. Okay, she's done, I stopped. Um, it works fine when I bring it back down the other way. So, I don't understand, unless it's a potentiometer, you would think if it was a wiring, maybe the wiring would cause that on this one, instead of this one, but I don't know. Just talking to Robert, K3RRR, apparently he's uh, gone through a lot of this stuff. But, uh, I'm just going to shoot it out there to see if anybody could uh, maybe help me out with the issue. I have a funny feeling it's a potentiometer in the uh, azimuth rotor, which I think is basically a G800 uh, Yeezy rotor. But, you know, when you buy things just pre-owned, uh, no matter, you never know what, what's going on with them. Okay, she's done. So, I'll turn that off and upload this to YouTube and, and share it with you guys.